Hi everyone, it's Jenea, and I just wanted to do a quick video of some happy mail I was sent from Beck. She is, hello, my name is Beck on both YouTube and Instagram, and I will link her down below. Um, I just unpackaged this, but I haven't looked yet. I did find the letter and read it though, and I absolutely love that it was a long le letter to read, and um, it was awesome just knowing a bit of what's going on in your life, Beck. And thank you so much for thinking of me. And yeah, so in the letter she told me that um, she used to work at a fabric shop. And so she has a big collection and wanted to share with me, which is super sweet. And I am excited to see what's here. So, um, first there's this, and I love this one. I love the flowers, and I have some ideas for that already. And I love this one too, it's green. And I know she was saying how she was, she always tries to look for the greens for me, because she knows I love green, and I love the shade. And it was super sweet of you to think of me especially living all the way in Australia and sending this to me. It was super sweet and I appreciate it. And this looks like, it almost looks like a little um, car. Yeah. Oh, that'll be fun to figure out. Something to do for my boys with that one. And... Oh, this would be cute to do something for my boys with two little farm animals. Oh, and this is a big piece. I could even, um, like back a quilt if I decided with this. It is quite a large piece. Oh, I love it. And all the little farm animals on there. I don't think I've ever seen fabric like some of these. I haven't been in a fabric store in a while though. Super cute. I'm hoping I'm in frame. And sorry about the lighting, it's really cloudy day, but I actually have a lull today. And this is super pretty. She wrote saying how she found some, um, I'm drawing a blank on the name. I believe they're called doilies. Um, at her local shop. And yeah, this one actually looks like it could be quite old. But I love it. It's so delicate and I love the swirl in it. It is super pretty. That'll look really pretty in a journal. And I am going to save this for last because I'm assuming it's what she made for me, so. Oh, I love this one. It has like little flowers in different shades of green, and I love the shades of green in this one. Hopefully they show up. Oh, and I love this too. I love that olive green, and of course I love flowers. That is so pretty. Thank you, Beck. I love all of those fabrics and, oops, sorry about that, and I already have some really great ideas for some of these, and that is super pretty too. Um, and I will go ahead and open this. It has a cute little bow on it. so pretty. So she also has some more of those crocheted doilies in here. Oh, I love the little ones. Super cute. And that's really pretty too. I love the shape of this one. 
Oh, and this one has like flowers throughout it. That's super cute. Oh, I love those, Beck. Thank you. And it's so sweet of you to share those. And this is the thing that she made for me. A little, it looks like flip book. And this is adorable. I love the flowers on there. And I love the soft colors and the greens. Super pretty. Oh, I love that. And that is like, oh, it almost felt velvety, but it's not. And there's flowers there. I love the green that she used. And I don't know where to start. Oh my gosh, she packed this thing. Beck is like a pro. I know this wasn't flat mail, but like this is pretty flat for all that it looks like is in there. She is so good at doing flat mail. Or at least flatter than I could ever do mail. <laughs> oh, this is adorable. It says journal, record of news or events, diary. I love that. As she knows that like in crafting, I definitely find the most joy in crafting journals. Um, I like making them for my friends and yeah, for my son. Now for my younger son. Oh, I love this. Um, these are all just little sayings and places to journal. Oh, I will definitely be adding these in my journal. Yeah, Beck knows me so well. I love those, Beck. I can't wait to add those to my journal. Especially with the sentiments that are on them, it'll be perfect because she knows I love journaling about my, well now, kids. Now it's plural. <laughs> And so some of those sentiments are so perfect for that. And I've been meaning to have um, a more personal journal on top of a journal for just talking about my boys and what they're up to. And these are little, like, small music sheets. Super cute. Oh, these would be funny. Not funny. <laughs> Sorry, lack of sleep. These would be fun to add to um, some like miniature journals that I make. Well, I haven't made one in a while, but I have ideas now. Thank you for that, Beck. And, oh my goodness. See, this is what I mean. This is packed. Alrighty. I can't believe that these survived the trip like they did. Oh, these are gorgeous. These are wax seals. Oh, since this one fell, I'm going to show you. Has a feather on it. Super pretty. And one says with love. And then there's a lot of florals. And she has three. She's put um, like some pieces of different dried flowers in. Those are so pretty, Beck. Hopefully they're showing up on my camera. I love those. Thank you for sharing those with me. Those are so special and unique. Okay, I will start from this little pocket here. You have just jam-packed this. And... Super cute. Yeah, she knows that will be perfect. Oh. Welcome, baby. Oh, these are all perfect for... Oh, baby boy. Hopefully I'm in frame here. Oh, cute. I love this. I sing Twinkle Twinkle to my son every night before bed. It's part of our little thing. Um, but yeah, so I love that. Oh, and I love that quote from... Um, I think it's called I'll Love You Forever. Can't remember right now. <laughs> but we have that book, and, um, I read that one to my son. Cute. Oh, these are so perfect. 
I love that. Hello, baby. With the little baby image. Oh, these are so perfect, Beck. <laughs> That's adorable. They're feeding the cat their milk. Oh, those are awesome. Thank you for those, Beck. Yes, those will be going in my journal for sure. I've actually just been trying to catch up with journaling since my son was born. Oh, I love this. That's so pretty. And there is more. Oh, I love the washi. I love how soft everything Beck makes um, is. Like, just really soft colors. Um, I love that she found some soft greens. Those are just super pretty. And there's a little washi sampler. And it matches the paper. I love it. It's super pretty. And I love this too. I love how she decorated this with the little typewriter on top of the flower here. And this flips out. Oh my god. <laughs> I love how you did that, Beck. That's so cute. She has a tag here that she's attached. And she has these tiny, all oh, the cutest paper clips ever all over. Those ones are so tiny and they have a heart inside. Oh, I love those. Those might have to go in uh, on a page I journal about my boys. The little hearts. So pretty. And there's a little envelope here with stamps. Oh, stamps from Australia. These are awesome. Oh, I love them. Oh, it's so special to have these too. Oh my goodness. There's so many. Like I said, holy cow, Beck. You are like queen of packing stuff into something that ends up being pretty flat for how much is in it. And there's flowers, birds, I love the birds. All of these are so pretty. A little koala. Perfect. Oh, thank you so much, Beck. That was so sweet of you. Oh, and kookaburros. I love those. Thank you so much. Um, thank you for thinking of me. And... Yeah, you know me so well, you always think of my boys, which is super special. And um, yeah, I can't wait to put some of this to use. Thank you so much. Um, and yeah, everything is so beautiful. Again, I will have Beck linked down below. Uh, she just makes things that are so different and so pretty. Um, thank you so much for everything. Uh, thanks for watching. I hope you all have a great day and I will see you in the next one.